गुड इवनिंग एंड वेलकम बैक टू पैसा बोलता है पैसा बोलता है मैं फिर से आपका स्वागत है हम फिर से हॉट टैक्स करेंगे हॉट टैक्स में क्या है कि आज जो न्यूज है इसके बारे में मेरा भाई पूछेगा मैं जवाब दूंगा जवाब अंग्रेजी में दूंगा पहले अगर बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट सवाल है तो मैं जरूर हिंदी में भी उसका अनुवाद करूंगा देखते हैं मेरे भाई क्या पूछता है for the top 1% of india definitely their spirits are high they will soar but most of the products that they will be consuming are high end uh, luxury goods and high end cars and things like that which are basically imported and will not make a big difference to the indian economy hmm. the second one is of course the middle class and the lower middle class this is people who are earning less than a lakh hmm. a month they will feel the pinch two reasons hmm. one in inflationary pressures are extremely high so but that are not being met mm. that is household budgets are going out of control mm. salary raises are not kept up with budgets mm. also a recent report said 5 lakh people have lost jobs mm. even people those who have not lost jobs mm. will become extremely careful when they see things around them mm. and they'll cut back on spending mm. because they don't want to splurge money when there is mm. a problem mm. the you can see this from two wheeler sales mm. two wheeler sales have not at hit an all time high the all time high was in 2018 Hmm. and even post camp covid the pre covid sales has crossed just by 4% hmm. so basically what uh, two wheelers are bought by the lower end segment people hmm. and sales of entry level cars are really down hmm. in fact maruti has said to get a substantial growth hmm. in maruti maruti needs entry level cars to do well hmm. so basically what is happening car sales which are doing well are more than 10 lakhs in cost hmm. so that is a very small portion of the market hmm. so there are two segments of the market hmm. the luxury and the ultra luxury will do very well hmm. the what whoever is dependent on the middle class and the lower middle class hmm. will not do well hmm. hindustan unilever has cut prices hmm. the slay has already hmm. reduced the sizes of the products hmm. so these will not do well hmm. in fact as a report in business standard which says 56% of houses sold hmm. in bombay are more than 1 crore hmm. so how many people can afford to buy a 1 crore house true okay Okay. and uh, ultra uh, luxury and luxury sales are doing households are increased by 115% hmm. led by hyderabad hmm. but uh, nobody is talking about hmm. people who really need the houses hmm. they are not going to get it hmm. so all the indications are very clear hmm. that premiumization is taking place hmm. a brand like titan is now saying that they will open showrooms where minimum purchase is 10 lakhs hmm. and minimum is uh, 10 lakhs and by invitation they will invite you. Hmm. So nobody is talking about a future for Sonata, hmm. which was their brand for the low end uh, jewelers. Correct. Or Tata Gold or whatever it was. So everybody is talking about the premium end of the market, hmm. which I am saying that is why we have been saying hmm. ad nauseum there is a K shaped recovery. Things are doing well. Hmm. You can see that Apple has done 50,000 crore sales, hmm. which is a record sale for them. Hmm. But who can buy Apple phones? Not many. Hmm. Uh, you you. you You need to spend at least ten to fifteen thousand. Uh, you have to spend about a lakh or rupees to buy an Apple phone. Correct. And how many people can afford it? Well, leading to what you're saying, the other headline is there's a boom in premium phones. And yeah. what's driving it? They're asking. Yeah. What is driving is the rich are getting richer, hmm. and the poor are getting poorer. Then what? What do you say to this? Which is coming? The next headline is Bangalore puts house above financial assets, saying people in Bangalore are more keen on buying houses. They are keen, yes. but how many can afford? Well, according to our article, most Bangaloreans. See that the, in Whitefield, which I visited recently, mm. there is a big move upwards in mm. rentals mm. because a lot of people have been forced to come to mm. work, mm. right? Mm. So there is a bump up in Whitefield, Electronic City, and all that. Mm. But when if you are losing jobs, mm. startups are finding difficult. Hmm. Right, startups are having a funding winter. Hmm. Danzo has not paid salaries, hmm. and everybody is cutting back on staff. Hmm. And there is a report in the same Mint paper, hmm. newspaper, which said five lakh people have lost jobs in the first uh, six months of the year in IT industry. Oh. So I am not able to understand. Hmm. So they may long for a house. Hmm. Have they bought a house? I do not know. This is a survey which says, what do you want? Hmm. Do you want to buy stock or do you want to buy house? Hmm. If you frame the question this way, ninety hmm. nine. Why Bangalore? Anybody? They're like asking, say, do you want to be rich? Everyone wants to be, be rich. rich. Yes. So, if I give you fifty lakhs, 
Hmm. Will you buy a house or will you buy stocks? Hmm. In India, everybody is going to say house. Hmm. So let me look at it and hmm. say, hmm. so many people have bought houses hmm. and what income band they have bought houses. Hmm. If you say houses more than one crore, hmm. it's with the upper class buying, not the lower people, class. lower people who really need the houses. Hmm. Hmm. Lower duty is likely for EVs priced up to $35,000. Hmm. Import duty to be maybe slashed by 215 to 30 percent with the caveat on local manufacturing. Are they allowing Elon Musk to... Of course, but uh, that's a minimum $35,000 hmm. is nearly how much? 25 no, lakhs right. plus nearly 30 lakhs plus 15 percent, nearly 40 lakh car. Yes. How many people can afford a 40 lakh car? So again... I'm, I'm saying hmm. our authorities have got their priorities hmm. completely misplaced. Hmm. The same thing like giving Apple a free run to manufacture in India, yes. you, you have given them production linked incentives. Hmm. It's a way to subsidize the rich. Hmm. And you have kept duties very high for hmm. Apple phones. Hmm. So the Apple phone from Japan or Apple from Dubai or Apple from US hmm. is far cheaper than buying Apple in India. Hmm. So you are basically giving hmm. a free run to smuggling. Hmm. So this is misguided policy. India's imports from Russia, oil imports has fallen in October as discounts narrow. There are two reasons. Hmm. One is oil prices have gone hmm. up so the, uh, Russia doesn't want to send you cheap. Hmm. Second, there was a big dream about de-dollarization, hmm. saying that there will be, Russia will take rupees. Hmm. Russia took a lot of rupees from us and gave us oil. Hmm. But there is nothing much which Russia wants to buy from us. Correct. So they left standard, standard with the dollars hmm. and RBI is, RBI is selling, please buy our bonds. They want yuan. They don't want they want their MB or the yuan because they can use it. They are saying no to dollars. So he is stuck with a lot of Indian rupee which he is packed in bonds because there is nothing much he can import from India. So much for de-dollarization <laughs> in India. De-dollarization dreams of India. And Indian rupee becoming the next reserve currency. No, that is way off. Cotton output may be the lowest in 15 years. So this is what is it going to mean? Hmm. It means that cotton exports have to be banned but nobody will ban cotton. Hmm. Cotton experts hmm. and uh, because everybody would like to export cotton worldwide, there may be a shortage. Hmm. This will mean that industries like Tirupur, Ludhiana and other places hmm. will find less cotton yarn and prices will go up hmm. and our exports will take a hit. Hmm. Already the rupee is extremely expensive hmm. compared to the dong, the Chinese rehembi hmm. and the Bangladeshi taka. Hmm. So this will mean if this goes through and output is as bad as it's expected, hmm then you are going to have lesser cotton and more cl costly clothes. So what do you say to this paddy purchase of decline as farmers hold back and run up to elections? No, no, they are not holding up because of elections. Hmm. This is Heinz a rear view hmm, mirror. mirror driving. Hmm. Because num the amount of so sown acreage has come down. Hmm. So there and there was no rain. Hmm. So definitely what is going to happen is hmm. नमस्कार फिर पैसा बोलता है मैं आपका स्वागत है मैं आनंद श्रीनिवासन हैदराबाद में इवेंट अच्छा हुआ इसके लिए मैं आपका आभारी हूं मैंने दुबई की टीम ने आइडिया बनाया कि अगली बार गल्फ में एक और इवेंट होल्ड करेंगे इस बार का इवेंट 24 नवंबर को आखिरी शुक्रवार नवंबर महीने में साढ़े पांच या छह बजे कुवैत में हुआ जो भी मुझे कुवैत में मिलना चाहे वो नीचे के डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स में दिया गया मेल आई में अपना मेल भेजे या व्हाट्सएप में संपर्क मेरी टीम उनको जरूर मदद करेगी धन्यवाद नमस्कार जय हिंद